Hello everyone, today's lesson is lesson 93, locating positive and negative numbers on a number line, and adding positive and negative numbers using a number line. Okay. So here I have this number line. Remember, the negative lines are always to the left of zero. And our positive numbers are to the right of zero. So when we read positive numbers, we usually do not say the word positive. I don't say positive 3. I just say 3. Okay. So I'm going to... Oh, when we have negative numbers, we would say negative 3. Now, 0 is neither positive nor negative. So here you can see um, the number 0 is right in the middle of my number line. So if I count by ones to write in the positive numbers, we would go 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And then the negative numbers go to the left. So we start at 0 and we go negative 1, negative 2, negative 3, negative 4, negative 5. So now we're going to use our number line to add positive and negative numbers. A positive number tells us to move right and a negative number tells us to move left. Okay, So with our first equation here, we have 5 plus 3 equals 8. So to show this addition problem on my number line, I always start at 0. Then I have a positive 5. So I'm going to go to the right 5 places. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then I'm going to add 3 more or go to the right three more times. One, two, three. And you see we ended up at positive eight, or just eight. Okay. Now, on this next one, we have five plus a negative three. Okay, so we have a negative three here. When a sign a uh, minus sign is right next to a number, and we already have another symbol, we would read it as negative 3. So first thing I'm going to do is start at 0. And then I have 5, and 5 is positive, so I'm going to the right. So I'm going to go to the right 5 places. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. But then I have a negative 3. The negative tells me I need to move to the left. So from going from 5, I'm going to go to the left three places. One, two, three. So five plus a negative three equals two, or a positive two. Okay. So on my next one, get these erased. Okay. This next one I have a negative five plus three. So the negative 5 tells me I'm going to move to the left 5 places. Starting at 0, we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then the positive 3 tells me I'm going to go to the right 3 places. So now that I'm at 5, I'm going to go to the right. 1, 2, 3. So negative 5 plus 3 equals a negative 2. Let's go ahead and do our last one. So we have negative 5 plus a negative 3. So the negative 5 tells me I'm going to the left 5 places. So starting at 0, we go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Then I'm going to go to the left 3 more places. 1, 2, 3. So my answer is negative 5 plus negative 3 equals negative 8. Okay, let's do some more. 2 plus 7. Okay, so starting at 0, we go over 1, 2, and then 7 more. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 2 plus 7 is 9. Our next one, we have negative 2 plus a negative 7. So that tells me I'm going to the left both times. So starting at 0, we're going to go two places, 1, 2, and then 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 
So negative 2 plus negative 7 is negative 9. Okay. This next one, the negative 2 tells me I'm going to the left, and the positive 7 tells me I'm going to the right. So starting at 0, we're going to the left, 1, 2, then we're going to go to the right, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So negative 2 plus 7 is 5. Okay, and our last one, we have 2 plus negative 7. So the 2 tells us we're going to the right, and the negative 7 tells us we're going to the left. So starting at 0, we go 1, 2 to the right, and then we're going to go 7 to the left. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 2 plus a negative 7 equals negative 5. Okay. And that is how we use a number line to add a positive and negative numbers. Thanks for watching.